welcome to Zuli Blue Crafts and my 365 days of crafting. My name is Julie and today I'm going to show you how to decorate pumpkins using chalkboard paint and a chalkboard pen. Let's get going. So what you will need for this project is some chalkboard paint. I have a few different colors here. I have a black, red, and a blue. And you will need a chalk marker and pumpkins. I'm going to use little pumpkins today. You can also do this on larger pumpkins. So let's do this. So what I did first is I took the Martha Stewart blue chalkboard paint and I painted half of the pumpkin. It only takes one coat. I'm going to finish painting that and then I'm going to set that down to dry. Once I've allowed the top part of my pumpkin to dry, I'm going to place it upside down on a glass and then I'm going to paint the bottom side. And I'm going to paint the whole bottom side and then let that dry another hour or so until it's completely dry. So I now have two pumpkins fully painted with the chalkboard paint and now I'm going to embellish them with my chalk marker. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to draw straight lines down on the natural seams of the pumpkin. And I want to do like a tribal effect, so I'm going to do arrows some dots and then I'm going to do different lines all the way around using the same theme of tribal so now that I have finished my tribal pumpkin using the chalk pen I'm going to go ahead and decorate this one. So what I've decided to do on this one is kind of a mandala type drawing. So I'm going to just start in the center and I'm going to just build the circle all the way out. And just use your imagination on your next outer circle. You can go on Pinterest or Google Mandala drawings for some ideas. So I'm just going to complete this and then I'll be back to show you the results. Wow, so I finished my mandala pumpkin and it was really, really easy. I just went online and Googled a mandala painting and just kind of went from there, just from the inside out, just kept adding layers. It took me literally about 10 minutes to do this and I think it came out amazing. So this is my Zen pumpkin and this is my warrior spirit pumpkin. So I hope you got some good ideas about designing pumpkins and I will see you next time.